So this week's Eat It Up is a little bit different, but it's all because you asked for it. We're gonna go plant-based. But we assure you, this is something for everyone. This local chef has an incredible story of using food as medicine, but having a lot of fun at the same time. She has some major street cred too. She just won a competition on the Food Network. Consider me in, are you ready? I'm ready. Let's, Let's eat, eat it up. Vito and Beer is a culinary wellness company named after my grandparents, Vito and Beer Damiani. They are the ones that inspired me with food and they taught me that food was more than sustenance. I am a plant-based chef because I believe that adding plants to your diet, no matter how small, it can change your life. So I still am an occupational therapist and began to study food as medicine. So when I started learning that, I knew I had to become a chef. It's not about the 1970s salad. I'm a plant-based person and that's all I eat. I would die. So I want the things that you want. I want the same texture. I want to get that warm and fuzzy feeling that you do when you eat chili that reminds you of your grandma. I can deliver all that and you don't walk away saying, where's the meat? You're eating healthy stuff, finally. Finally. <laughs> that was so good. A refreshing little snack. Mm -hmm. Acidity, the, the yeah. summertime cucumber-ish kind of refreshment. All right, Karen, may I serve you some salad? Oh, please do. Okay, all right, I want to get that chip there. Mm -hmm. The chips are so good. It's just such a quick snack on the go. You know where this was four days ago? I bet in the ground. You're right. Now it's in my belly. <laughs> what I decided was I can do meals to go, and that's how we started, and we're still doing that. We deliver Sunday morning, generally 9 to 11. You can go to Drug Emporium. If you want the frozen product, you can go to Green Corner Store. If you don't, my grandparents would be just so thrilled that I'm honoring them and to know that they made a difference. What do you say we have a little bit of chili? Ooh, Ooh chili on a yes. cold morning in Arkansas. Bring it on. Chef, that's one of my favorite chilies I've ever had. Mm -hmm. Wow. That's loaded with flavor. And it feels like your grandmother's chili. Yes. Just days ago, pulled things out of the ground, and now we're eating them on our plate. I don't think it gets much more fresh than that. <laughs> I would like to say to Vito and Vera. To Vito yeah, and Vera. Like my heart. Vera. Cheers. Salute. Such an incredible woman. Uh, here's the part of her story that I find so remarkable. She worked decades in the healthcare industry. That's when she saw the need for higher quality foods. Mm -hmm. And so she literally pauses her career and goes to culinary school. <laughs> Just stops it. That was three years ago. So mm -hmm. in a matter of three years from graduating, she goes on to win a major Food Network mm -hmm. competition. And if that doesn't tell you how good her food is, I don't know what does. And she was the only plant-based chef in that competition, right. which mm. the other chefs were like, Wow, we got this. My favorite part. And she wins. She wins. My favorite part was that you just didn't taste anything missing. It tasted no. like the real things you come to know and love: tacos and pastas. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. You see, you saw some the of the, the, chili, the chili. The salad. Chili was good. You have chili. no clue. There's no meat in that. You have no right. really. Okay. The chips were Scott's favorite. They were made out of some type of gourd. We're not yeah. really sure. Mm -hmm. I don't think it was squash, but they had seeds in them. They were crisp. They were savory, delicious. A couple of ways to take advantage of her recipes mm -hmm. and our food you can either order for delivery uh, on our website I'll have that posted on thv11.com or you can now go to a few retail stores around the metro where she sells uh, some of those frozen milk kits there we uh, go so you have lots of options to choose from